Hi. Those mothers rip me off. Rip me off. I'm dying here. Oh yeah. Are you Mercurio? Uh, yeah. You looking for the astrolite? Oh yeah. I'm. Oh, I can feel a draft on my fucking insides. Please yeah. Me, you bastards. Bastards. The blood ain't working no more. My head, it feels cracked. Probably is. Oh, I think my eyes popped. So he got beat up. We're gonna go get the bomb. We're gonna go get the money, and then we're gonna. Actually, we should get him painkillers first. I know I kind of skipped it there, but... But, uh... Boom! Boom. Morphine bottle. I need blood. <laughs> Yo, nurses have decent blood. Huh? Oh. Oh, we're okay. Mercurio! I got morphine for you, baby. Mercurio? I bought some morphine. Hold still. Hope that helps. Goodbye. We got four points of XP. Um, where are we gonna put it? I kind of want to put it into defense. Where is it? Dodge? Is it dodge? Yeah. Can we? Can we just like? Let's accept it. I used three points to put in defense. Can we be like so tanky? We're almost invulnerable, and then just seduce everybody? <laughs> is that possible? Beat Jaxus. Look, in these old games, you have to use the actual... The devs set up um, instructions? Directions. So if you weren't using your big brain... Also, is the Asylum a real band? Because it sure looks like it. Oh, no. Die, my darling? The Empire Hideouts. I'm going to look them up. I bet that's real. I've seen a lot of shocking things in my time on the Force, but that pier... That's the kind of thing that makes you lose your faith in humanity. I gotta say, it's the second worst thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Okay, that first cop sounds like Jordan Peele doing like a voice. Up there, uh. through that chain link gate and up those stairs. Okay, thanks. Bye. <laughs> Look at this Chad right here. Help ya! Oh, I can seduce him. Do I look dangerous to you? I'm sure a big man like you isn't. Oh my god. Okay. I tell you what, I'll let you in. Sure. If on your way out, you want to work out a little fair trade for future purchases, you come see me. I'm Brian. Oh, goodness. I'll think about it, Brian. See you. Sweet. <laughs> Sup, dorks? <laughs> oh, okay. It's supposed to be a video game. Okay. We're doing that too, bro. We got so much in common. Yo, he's doing magic tricks. Look at his cards. Okay. See, if I didn't have a few points in perception, it, shit wouldn't be glowing like that. Oh, jeez, I'm stuck. I'd have to actually look for it myself. You know how hard that would be? Now we gotta get the... Oh, no. The explosives. What? Why? What? What happened? What happened? Ah. Ah. Ah, yes. Humans, humans, humans. Gun, gun, gun. Oh, he's not human. Ah! I'll take that. Uh, three shots. Okay. I don't think these guys, none of them are human. Oh my god. I gotta reload again! I'm stuck! Ah, I'm sandwiched! <laughs> Come on. One of you is. I'm s Look at him go! Look at him go! Don't you don't you don't you don't! Hit him! Yes! 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 Ah! Alright. Sup, baby boy? Presence. Ah! Uh, let me suck ya. Yes. Oh, you don't have good blood, my friend. But it was enough. You'll suffice. <laughs> Sweet. Let's get out of here. Mercurio. My baby, Mercurio. My ghoulish boy, just dying. Are you dead? 
Curio. How do I find- I just got a message! Oh, it's a group chat that I never fucking talk in because I'm ashamed of myself and have weird so social issues. So we have to talk to this guy, Tong. Right? To get to know where the warehouse that we have to blow up is. To get to Tong, because he's in hiding, we have to talk to the owner of the Asylum uh, Dance Bar. That's an interesting character in there. So we have to do a quest for her right now. And now I wonder, since we gave the money back to Mercurio, I wonder if we'll see him later and he'll be like, Hey, thanks for giving me the money back. Or not, this was 2004. You can't expect games to be from 2004 to not have plot holes. Uh, who can we talk to? Who's talk to a bull? Uh, you look generic. You look generic. You don't look generic. Okay, you are generic. Uh, <laughs> people meeting me. <laughs> you... No, that's okay. Look at us going in the alleyways like a like a wretch. You look like a vampire. What's the hops, bro? What's the hops, bro? <laughs> oh jeez, are you okay, dude? Something I can help you with. I already don't trust you. Uh so how you doing? Bye then. Okay, that guy's got some problems, I'll tell you what. It's so quiet in here. No one's talking, and it's just an old lady on her fucking type, on her... <gasps> okay. What do we have here? Another scrumptious young plaything straight out of life and into my club? She's a vampire, look at her teeth. Oh, like God. Like do on freshly mowed AstroTurf. I'm not frightening you, am I duckling? Uh, okay, you lost me on duckling. Uh, oh, f frightening isn't it? the word I'd use. Exciting is more like it. Oh my god, okay, let's seduce her. <laughs> I can tell you and I are going to get along just like fire hoses. Fire hoses? When we get turned on, there's bound to be uh, Who are you? Oh, no, let's just keep going. That's what I was thinking. What's your and name? The finger down your spine when all the lights are out. Wow. And the name on all the men's room walls. When I pout, the whole world tries to make me smile. And everyone always wants to know who is that girl. Uh, the last line lost me. I am Jeanette. Jeanette, okay. And this bit of chaos crammed in a certifiable giggle is my club. <sighs> I just love to give you funny feelings all night, sweetheart, but I really must trouble with some business. We'll reunite sweet and soon, I promise. Soon won't come soon enough. Goodbye. Okay, why are we watching her? Okay. Yo, look at that gimp guy! I need to go to a place where people look like this. <laughs> IRL. I just want to sit on a table and just be there. Um, right. I'm on the wagon. I'm not a drinker or a bar goer, so I don't know what that means, so we're gonna say it. You sure? I make a mean bloody Mary. I'm sure you do. A big man like you must have lots of talents. I wonder if we'd have to do like a little quest for him to tell us where Therese is. Yeah, yeah, I hear that from everyone, sweetheart. Alright, cool. So now I wonder if like, since we seduced him, or had a seduce option, um, that maybe there was like a quest that we had to do. We don't gotta eat, suck anybody, okay. Hi. Oh, man, you. You're a vampire, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Oh, he's a ghoul. Look at him. See? Big face, big ears. Yes, I am. Hell yeah! Oh, man, I knew it. I just, oh, jeez, I knew you were, I just couldn't tell. Like, oh, man, this is great. And I saw your teeth in there, and I was like, damn, it was like I could just sense you. Your name's Knox Karen. I need to meet you. 
Knox Harrington. Sup? Are you a vampire? The pleasure's all yours. <laughs> Leave me alone, jackass. Are you a vampire? Yeah, it's a ghoul. Sweet. You said you were a ghoul. What is that? Oh, this guy's gonna educate us. Jeez, oh man! <laughs> you seem to enjoy it. A nasty dude. Oh, man. His name's Bertram, he knows Bertram. No kidding. Small word. I'm looking for him. Oh, ah. What do you need to tell him? So what's the problem? Oh man, this guy, this, this thing got wise to me. Now instead of me watching him, he's watching me, you know? I see this guy appear around me all the time, like off in the distance watching me, he'll warp up next to me. Oh man, and... <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um. Oh my god, we got a quest? Want me to take care of it? Hell yeah! Right on! Okay, like I said, he's some kind of Asian vampire thing. <laughs> the only clue I got is this driver's license that he dropped once while I was taking Oh, jeez. so freaked out that I haven't even had a chance to check it out. Driver's license. Shouldn't that tell you who he is? No. The picture on the license isn't him. I don't know why he had it, but, well, it might help you find out where he is and what he's doing. All right. right on. Quest log updated. Sounds good, Knox. Um, what's Bertrand like? Do you like being a girl? Actually, alright. Alright, this guy activated the quest, which is cool. Do you guys want to see the best dance moves this side of the planet? Check it out! Yes! Yes! If you stay in here long enough, they start dancing with you. This game is good. I hope the game isn't too loud over my voice, because it's pretty loud in my ears. Okay, what's this? Your Gold ring. Last time I looked, it was called Santa Monica, not stuck up bit. Oh, they're fighting. Oh, can't even look at you sometimes. Oh, Therese, you really do paint a flattering portrait of me with your turn of the century bar. I always assumed you could do nothing but look down on me. They sound exactly the same. Concealing that dirty, diseased mind. Sin! You have no sin. <laughs> Let's see who is without sin past the fierce tone. Go ahead and mock me. You pull your pranks, make fun of my ways. It suits you. You're just one big joke. Don't you call me that. Should I start calling a duck a pig as well? I'm your sister. How can you treat me like this? <laughs> wow. Okay. Run away from the truth. I'll take care of everything, as always. Okay. T the door of arguments only unlocks when it's done. Hello, Therese. Please, come in. I do apologize for my sister's crassness if it made you uncomfortable. She's unabashedly scandalous, but in the club business, I suppose that kind of personality is a necessary evil. If you say so. I guess that means you're Therese. Therese Vorman, yes. I'm the proprietor of this club, and the only person in this city whose good side it's in your best interest to stay on. You the boss. What brings you to Santa Monica? I need you to call off the feud with Bertram Tung. Tung's exile is self-imposed, I assure you. 
But then, what reason would I have not to hate that loathsome Nosferatu scoundrel? Ah. Bloody Nosferatu. Ah. They're so unclean. Hey, it's not his fault, I think. Your phobias don't concern me. Tell me to everything. everything's cool. Hmm. I'd be willing to put the word out that my grievances with tongue have been swept under the rug. But in return, you'll have to help me remove a particularly burdensome spirit from a property I'm looking to invest in. Right. Another goddamn... I'm not trying to be mean here. Um, a spirit? You mean a ghost? Couldn't I just kill you? Bertrand would be willing to help me out, I'm sure. Oh my god. Gladly, what do I have to do? Rumor is that a personal item of a ghost may be used to draw it out or excise it from its haunt. While I don't put a lot of stock in hearsay, it's my last option. So I want you to go to the Ocean House Hotel, sure. find an item of the spirits, and bring it back. Let's go. Oh, I fully intend to do so. You'll find that dealing with me on the whole is appreciably more predictable than dealing with some of the egomaniacs that are my peers. Yeah. So long as our business doesn't go sour, my word is gold. Wow. I can respect that and appreciate it. Before Goodbye. I forget, take this. The only way to reach the ocean house this time of night is through a tunnel in the sewers. You'll need that key to open. Wow, okay. If that's what it takes to if get that job done. Me, I've got situations to set straight. Sure. Let's just do it. Let's not get too deep into it, you know? Oh, I want your bed. Can I have this? Ugh. Ugh. Ooh, that's scary. No, that's scary. Jesus. <laughs> he looks like that actor that played um the old man in the Saw movies. Okay, I can't go in there. Alright. The Ocean House Hotel, like she said. Okay, so we gotta go down the long way and then turn left. Ah, yes! Okay, I remember. I remember, I remember, I remember. There we go. Here we are. I wish I kept the recording of experiencing this place for the first time. Um, yeah, so, let's see if it can scare me again. Ah! We're in! Nice. So here we- Look, there's a man! Oh, there he goes. You missed. Don't you whip stuff at me again. Ah! Jeez. Oh my god. Santa Monica celebrates New York's hotel. Sweet. It's dark. Maybe Auspex will help us a bit, huh? I've already been through this and I'm scared still. Is that a little radio? Oh, it is. Okay. Oh, no. Don't you whip stuff at me. Who, who, dodge. Okay. Check it out. We strong as hell. Mm, what's this? Child severed head found in the hotels. Great, great, great. Need some grease on that door, I'll tell you what. Right, the head and the... Okay. Boiler room key. This key is labeled boiler room. Sweet. Hmm. Um, so we're just gonna move on. And I'm gonna save my blood, cause... Damn. I used blood buff twice and auspex twice. And that's how... Is this guy a? This guy does not really scary. He's just a guy with a fedora and an axe or a sledgehammer. I can't really tell at this point. Yes. Power on. And it's noisy. Ah, I took damage from something. Uh, this is kind of overwhelming. Okay. Okay. 
Nice music. Sounds like me trying to play piano. <laughs> what? <laughs> Look, a ghost lady. No, that's gonna fly at me. I'll see you later. Oh, she's gone. What you looking at, lady? Police say second child was chopped up like firewood. Whoa, a mystery. Some loud doors. Hello, Mr. Door. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. The psychology is paper thin. Who was the abusive one in the family? Mm. Dodge! Dodge! Sweet. What do we got here? Ocean house upstairs key. A room key. Sweet. Who that? That's IRL people. I wonder who that is. Get out. I wonder. Ooh, anything in here? Ghost lady said go in here. This room looks burnt. Smash. Ah, a secret bar? Ocean House Killer possibly responsible for Inferno. Yeah, probably. Uh, my perception isn't picking up anything in here, so... We're just gonna move on. Eh. Yes. Mm, I don't like going more down. Oh my god, if I was a kid, I'd be hanging out in this thing all the time. Oh, the music again. Diary. TLDR. Can't go that way. Nah. No, how do I dodge this? Come on. Come on. Toss all the pots at me. Let's go. Pro gamer move. Dodge it all. Everything's on fire now. Holy smokes. Get me out of here. Okay. That was fun. That was a good time. Huh. <laughs> Crawling through the vents. A classic. A classic horror game. Be I'm so careful, lady. I'm the carefulest. What's so funny, huh? Platformer! Can we? It feels like we can. Yes. Uh. Oh, that's cool. Ghost fire? Wow. Wow. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. More ghost fire. Duck it. Duck it. Duck it. Doesn't matter, we still took all the damage. Um. Oh, jeez. Ah, this is much better. Who read all these books, huh? Who reads like that? Alright. Pendant. Retrieve pendant from the ocean house. So I guess that's the thing we needed for Therese. Experience point! Let's go! Quest log updated. You've recovered the journal from the ocean house. According to its contents, a jealous husband murdered his wife and family because of a locket. What a petty, petty man. The murderous ghost of the husband means to keep her trapped here forever with him. And she seems to be trying to help you find a way to free her. Okay. Oh, I thought the curtain in the distance was like a really big dress. I don't know if you can see that. I think we're done here. Let's, uh... Let's skedat, shall we? Whew. I know it may not sound like it, but I was, I'm actually... I was really tense in there. Like, IRL. Like, my shoulders were up. And everything. 
And as soon as I clicked E on the exit door, they went down. So... Say goodbye to the ocean house, I guess. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Same, bro. What's the haps, bro? <laughs> Therese? You're not Therese. How odd. I was just having naughty thoughts about you. So they're twins, wow. You made quite an impression earlier. Did you come up just to cheer lonely little me? Alright, this is already getting a little old. Uh, I brought this for Therese. Ooh. <laughs> Can I see it? Take it. No. I'm not just some silly doll, you know. <laughs> oh no. All my life, my sisters made me out to be a joke. She told you I was an embarrassment, didn't she? That I couldn't tie my shoes, let alone hold on to something for her. Is that it? I'm sorry, lady, but you have issues. Your makeup just always looks like you're crying. Okay. Uh, please calm down. She's always belittling me. She's the smart one. She's the favorite. She's the successful one. Well, that's not fair. I'm not a fool. This club's success is just as much my doing as it is hers. Sure. I understand, but I can't give it to you. Do you understand what it's like to have your own flesh and blood ripping you apart on a daily basis for two lifetimes? Can you- Oh my god. I'm still not gonna give it to you, lady. I'm sticking to my guns. I'm sorry to hear that, Jeanette, but I really need to give this to Therese. Fine. You hold on. Oh my god, how quickly she just switches Since it. you were so willing to brave that big spooky place for my darling sister, how about doing a teensy tiny favor for little troubled me? That depends on what it is. Do you know Gallery Noir down the street? I happen to know there's a charity event being organized there. Lots of influential Santa Monicans slithering in for token appearances. <laughs> But there's one thing they don't know. What's that, eh? The whole event's been set up by a kindred trying to establish their own power click in our city. And we can't let that happen, can we? So I need some brilliant young upstart to spoil the milk. <laughs> I could just... Should I? Like, personally, I don't trust this lady. She scares me. <laughs> But let's just use our abilities. For you, anything. <laughs> I promise this won't take long. Take this knife. Give the paintings in the gallery a good slashing. Don't get caught, and don't turn it into a massacre. And steal the charity box, would you? <laughs> Buy yourself something velvet. Oh, I can keep the money? All right, I'll and go slash paintings. These will be thrilled to honor your agreement when you get back. Whatever, oh, let's go do it. Oh, it was, oh, shit, I skipped it. Oh, there was something on the paintings. What was it? I can't remember. Oh, have fun. Right. Right, okay. So, my memory is sloppy. My memory is sloppy toppy, but uh, this is about as far as I got the first playthrough. Yeah, like you go in there and you hit some paintings and like a blood thing comes out. I remember some things, but I forget most things. I've always been like that. I've always had memory issues. Uh, is it bad to pick locks? Like, Let's go around the back. Hey, hey, oh, hey, boy. hold on a minute there. I'm Ugh. afraid you're committing a 351. That's trespassing on private property. I'm gonna have to ask that you vacate the premises immediately, or I'm afraid I'll be forced to radio this in. You're not a tough guy, are ya? Oh, we can seduce him! Wow, the way you said that was so good. <laughs> Let's go. Well, Missy. That's just a natural response of people uh, to someone in my kind of position. Uh, right? The risk, the prestige, the authority. It's a tough job, but somebody's got to do it. Wow. You want to know a secret? Power is a real turn on for me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you know, you'd be surprised how often I hear that in this line of work. Uh, <laughs> it's a uniform, you know. Women just can't get over the uniform. Yeah. Oh, don't stop talking. Well, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, if I continue to engage you in conversation, it's a violation of Code 613. How about we get to know each other a little better right now? Oh, we zuck him! Okay. I actually needed to. Let's go. Does he have good blood, though? Did you s He's got decent blood. Not the best, but it's enough for now. Okay. 
You dropped your keys. Oh, he's gotta get. He's gotta get. Let's get out of here. So we gotta slash some paintings, eh? And steal this. Yes. Shit. Oh no, I lost humanity. And since I, oh no, I lost two points of humanity, right? Oh no. Oh god, wait, is this a Bible story? I never read the Bible. <laughs> Cain meets Lilith. Nope. Cain meets Abel. Uh, Cain is cursed by God. Okay. Cain meets Lilith. Cain spurns Lilith. Easy. Hello. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see how much damage he takes from the GAT. Four. Two. Okay. I'm no uh, pro gamer. But I would say that the gun is ineffective against this guy. So we're going to switch to the bot. Yeah! How do we block again? It's tab? That didn't help. Can we block this guy's moves? Oh, he's not doing physical damage. He's doing magic damage. Oh, my goodness. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, my goodness. I hope. Oh, when was the last time we saved? This guy's going to kill us. Oh, my God. Wow. Oh, look. His model changed to like a real... Well, let's pray the last save was close by. Okay, 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 okay. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. What's up, baby boy? We're gonna blood buff the whole way through this little fight. So we're not gonna steal the money this time, because it gives me one less humanity. And being the race I picked, you don't want to lose humanity, because it takes twice as much effort to get it back. Right, uh... No, 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 no. Don't touch me. Uh, blood buff! Don't touch me. Got him. Missed. Oh, we got three free hits. Oh, my God. How the heck are we... Yeah. Am I doing this wrong? Did... I should have saved right as we walked in the door. I already made a mistake. Well... The... How the funky town, man? Oh, we can level up. Seven points. We're gonna be tougher, yes. So maybe we can take more damage. From oh! And then we're gonna blood buff. And we're gonna beat the shit out of him. Yes! Look at that damage. We can do this now. We can just brute force it. Wow. Okay. We're learning. So we're not gonna. St I wish he dropped something. Did we get a point? Oh, we got three points. What can we spend it on? <laughs> Maybe we should put a point in melee, eh? Okay. I don't want to steal the money because that'll uh, screw up my humanity. I think we can zuck this guy. Where is that damn tow truck? Looking for a little company? I've suddenly got the urge. <laughs> Sorry, I skipped it. I certainly got the urge. Oh, yeah, this guy's got good blood. Look how long that's taking. Uh, ah, okay. See you later, hot stuff. Hey there, need a date? Uh, they only had like five voice actors for this whole game, and they're all like top notch now. <laughs> it's so cool. You, what were you thinking? The museum. That was my event. Did you think <laughs> I wouldn't find out? Uh, Therese, listen. Shut up. <laughs> I, I could control my sister as long as tongue was out of the picture, but nothing's changed. I should have expected that you'd succumb to Jeanette's influence like all the others, but how dare you! Hey! I did, but I didn't. Okay? I didn't do what I swear. I can't just say yeah! Don't lie to me! Jeanette already confessed she tricked you into doing it. It was probably all tongue's idea. I'll deal with them later. 
But that's still no excuse for you ruining my museum. At least I got your damned item from the ocean house. Here, take it. My museum is wrecked! Do you understand? Oh my god! Now, if you'd like to atone, or if you'd like to provide further assurance of your innocence, I have one more task that has to be dealt with. Let's go. I made some threats against my sister. Idle threats, involving fire and her impious satin sheets. She <laughs> took them quite seriously, and is avoiding me. I want to meet with her, and explain that they were said in the heat of the moment. I asked her to meet me at the Surfside Diner, to reconcile. Okay. I'm busy with the club and my other endeavors. I'd like you to go to the diner and promise her that I don't plan to take any action against her. Wait for her in the back booth, near the phones. Um, okay. If the Baron of Santa Monica wants her sister back, I'll get her sister back, let's go. For all her unwholesome diversions and irritating disruptions, I should be less tolerant of her. She is my sister, however. Okay. And I suppose I'm obligated to forgive her her trespasses. I did sire her after all. Please. Oh my god. About it. Okay. You sired your own sister. That's cool. Twin sister. Y'all look exactly the same. Just with different makeup and hair. Clothes. Wait for her near the phones. Alright. What? Are y'all human? Because I got a gat too. Hey, where you going, man? Am I just being set up? Got him. Six shots left. Make him count. Nope. Huh, 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 dodge. Ah. Uh. Shotgun, damn! Jack wasn't kidding. I'm out of ammo. Oh my god. Oh, yes! Fuck. I don't want to get close because he'll. Ah! One more shot. Ah! Oh no, that's stinky. Okay. Um. Wow, we got a shotgun now though, so Oh yeah, you have to you, you don't got good blood. Well no, he has good blood. I'm sorry I doubted you. It's a good guy right there, high status, tell you what. Hello. It was a setup. Listen, I know we've had our differences, but you have to trust me. Therese tried to have you killed. I had to lock myself in the bathroom because now she's got a gun and please you have to help me. Why should I help you? Teresa's gonna kill us. Without me, you'll never get out of Santa Monica alive. Hurry! I don't know how much. Okay. In the club? Is there a bathroom in the club? Wait, I think we got some points to five points. What can we use this on now? Intelligence, wits, defense, wits. Let's go. Okay, not here. Back up here? I actually don't know where to go. I'm assuming back up here. Because this is like the only place we meet Therese and um, Jeanette. Oh, wow. You stay out of this. Oh! Okay. Would risk their life for this They're the same person. Waste of blood. They're the same person. Just make it easier to kill both of you. Help! Save me and I'll help you find Bertram. I swear. Shut up, Jeanette. I warned you to stay away from Tongue. He's turned you against me. I always looked out for you, but you couldn't stand my success. You wow. had to meddle, didn't you? I didn't want it to end like this, but you forced me. You never gave me any credit for anything, Therese. I was the one calling the shots. Bertram was dancing on my leash. How does it feel to know that I beat you? Isn't it obvious? I'm about to rid the night of this deviant, backstabbing whore. Do you realize that despite her condition, she still fornicates with kind, no less? So despicable. 
so oh, wow. unclean. You're one to talk, dear sister. Do you hear that or thunder through my Daddy's microphone? Little girl. Do you want to know just how depraved the Baron of Santa Monica can be? Shut up, Jeanette. You'd love the world to think you're a saint. When you thought I was asleep, I used to hear Father come in at night. What? For how much he loved you in your ear before he... Don't finish that sentence or you're dead. Wow. Okay, uh... You're just going to let her blabber secrets like that, Therese? Let's work through your trauma. Jeanette, I mean Therese. Had his way with you, and he didn't have to force you. You went limp and became his plaything. Do you think I didn't hear it? Night after night, always the obedient daughter until shut up. Just shut up. I'm disturbed. I kind of don't wait. Oh my god, this is would you like to tell the story? <laughs> she makes herself out to be the virgin queen of the night, pious as a nun, stable as the Earth's orbit. But it's all an act, isn't it? I'm the good girl. You're the wicked one. Um, nothing but plot against me when I had our best interests at heart. I'm legitimately disturbed. That, I've always covered up your mistakes. I've taken care of you. And this is how you repay me? Taken care of me. You've done nothing but keep me down. Blame me for every mistake. Did you expect me to let you rule my life until the end of time? No, sister. You've had it coming since our last sunrise. Is that right, dear? If it wasn't for me, you would have never survived this long. Remember? They tried to separate us, but I refused. I chose this life and brought you into it so that we could stay together. Obviously, you've forgotten. Wow. Um... <laughs> Whew. She's a control freak. People, things, emotions. If she can't control something, she gets rid of it. And you're a wild animal. You'll rub up against anything that'll take you in for the night. Then when you're stuffed and bored, you bite the hand that fed you. Therese will never let you live. You disappointed her. I used you, yes, but I didn't try to have you killed. Therese has no problem with killing, do you? Remember father? Father loved me. I was a good girl. Oh my god. I always did what I was told. You always hated that he loved me. You disobeyed him. You brought men home when he wasn't there. You were an awful daughter to him. Oh my god, okay. Ugh, Father I... came home drunk one day and mistook me for Therese. Because I'd fallen asleep in her bed. Don't listen to her. She's lying. Oh Therese my god! He was there and she saw me lying with him and so she went to the closet and pulled out his hunting shotgun, loaded it with deer shot and blew his mind out all over the silly What? Wall Did I see a person? A lie. Father killed himself because of Jeanette. She made him miserable. As I recall, he died with a smile on his face. Wow. Should I believe either of them now? But they're the same person! Okay. I'll believe you, Jeanette! As you shouldn't. I'm afraid, sister. I must write your ending in this family saga. And I want you to know, I do so with great anger. Wait, and is she gonna... Sh I had such hopes that you'd change for the better with my guidance. But so, sweet sister, is this how it has to end? I admit I always knew this night might come. Well, any message you want me to give father? An apology? A love letter? Grab the gun, Jeanette! Finish her off, Therese! Give me the gun! Jeanette, grab the gun! I killed her. I didn't want her to go. I only wanted her to change. You understand, don't you? Poor, poor Therese. You wanted to find Bertram. He's at the old gas station <laughs> the oil tank. He'll help you because I'll ask him to. But you must keep your tongue tied tight about what happened this night. Understand? I understand. Don't hesitate to come see me once in a while. I'm going to be so lonely without Therese. Oh my god. I mean, I may need someone like Maybe we made a mistake, huh? And I made a I mistake. Do get bored so easily. Maybe you could come by and cheer me up sometime. I'll think about it. You kind of scared me too. <laughs> That's just true. Wow, okay. Anything in here? Oh, nice tub. So that was a roller coaster. Um, I think that's a good spot to end this one. 
Did we make a mistake? I don't know. 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 We'll talk to uh, Bertram next one, okay? Okay.